Under President Joe Biden, deep-pocketed nonprofit organizations allied with the Democratic Party have earned a key seat at the policy shaping table, staying in close contact with the government as it works to reverse Trump-era rules. Harris, now the presumptive 2024 Democratic presidential nominee, has hosted the leaders for meetings at her private residence and other locations including the Eisenhower Executive Office Building, Visitor Locks Show. The visitors include the likes of George Soros' son Alex Soros, Stephen B. Hines of the Rockefeller Brothers Fund, and various heads of progressive groups linked to the Biden-Harris administration's policy agenda. News of Harris's willingness to entertain the nonprofit heads, who have also attended meetings with Biden and top officials such as John Podesta, with deep connections to the left-wing policy world, comes as Democrats seek to link Trump to outside groups on the right with their own ambitions to influence policy. The Biden-turned-Harris campaign has made a foe of the Heritage Foundation's Project 2025, a coalition of conservative groups making suggestions to a potential next GOP administration. Democrats have baselessly alleged Trump's campaign is behind or being influenced by Project 2025, which the former president recently disavowed whereas federal records suggest progressive special interests tangibly have the ears of Biden and Harris to shape policy. Harris, who is polling an average of roughly two percentage points below Trump, has hosted the nonprofit leaders since 2021, Visitor Logs Show.